food ain't cheap though. Luego andaba llorando la pobre que no le gustaba su cabello. Que... Do you MVP for the game? Thank you, thank you. Can I be fine? Or it's not gonna be fine, so. My man just shaved his head. Hey guys, we're gonna do a weekly vlog this week because I haven't done one in a while. Uh, just to give you a little backstory of what has happened, today is Monday. I did Zumba this morning, Pilates this afternoon, but last week I didn't do too much working out. Last week, what did I do last week? Oh, last week I recorded all of my foods for the week. And honestly, I do like those videos, so go check it out. That's my last, like, it's kind of like a weekly vlog because it is like all week, but literally I just show what I ate. So I didn't show like any hair related things because y'all know I'm a hairdresser, like nothing from work, no workouts, no nothing. Literally all I showed was food. <laughs> Wednesday I work all day and I'm doing actually my second official extension client. If y'all have seen my vlogs, y'all know I've been working on my extension certification, finally got that. Started doing my first extension client officially. I've only had her. And so this is gonna be my second official girl. Her hair is kind of like very similar to my first girl. It's a little bit shorter, a little bit more fine. She wants length, she wants fullness. And her hair is like a brown, but it's like faded on the ends. So we're gonna color her hair to match the extensions and we're gonna install two rows. So I'm excited about that. That's gonna be Wednesday. And then I think I have like two haircuts after her. Thursday is booked back to back. Friday is not booked yet. And then Saturday, I wanna say my morning is booked also. So my afternoon is still available. Um, but that's the week of my work. I'm also alone this week because my husband is all the way overseas playing hockey and I'm actually watching his game right now. So it's live, which is nice that, so we can watch it. I love that the, por not the porteros, the, um, announcers like they're in colum they're in colombia right so the announcers are talking in spanish and i can understand everything so i love that let me play a little bit so y'all can hear So there's my husband in the goal. But yeah, I'm just gonna watch this game. I'm thinking I wanna make a pizza also because I'm hungry. And I have piña right now actually, so. I might as well. Cause I do like pineapple on my piña. Er, pi pi I like piña on my pizza. <laughs> and shout out Jill. She's um, one of the girls I work with. If you're watching this Jill, thank you for my pineapple cutter because I used it for the first time yesterday. And I really cut this pineapple in two seconds when it usually takes me way longer. <laughs> Are you playing truth all day? Look how delicious my pizza looks. All for me. Uy, me pareció que era falta ahí en el área, pero no, no la pitaron los jueces. Oh, Chemo, directo. Sí podría ir. Oh, y aquí controló. Estados Unidos. Ahí está el eco en la tribuna también, importante lo que hace, lo que hizo Nicolás Stauffer, el portero de Estados Unidos. 2 a 1 está el juego, Chile está arriba en el marcador. Good morning. We are currently losing 7 to 2. Colby's a little free shot. Let's see what happens. A ver, atento entonces, José Alves, portero de Argentina. Oler que intenta. Yeah. Al fondo gol de Estados Unidos. Game just ended. They lost. I don't even know what the score was. Like 11-3, 13-3. And y'all, I'm sore from yesterday. Oof. My legs. <laughs> I think I want to clean up the living room and then we'll do yoga. Because I wanted to do yoga, but now I'm like looking at the living room and kind of looking rough. Wow, who would have known that our raggedy couch actually can look decent? <laughs> 
Okay, so I'm just gonna clean over here too. Oh, you got my ideas. <laughs> Clean. Okay, so one day, like probably two weeks ago, I fed this squirrel. Well, I don't know if it's the same one, but I'm assuming it is. Look at him. <laughs> I think he wants some snacks, but I honestly don't have any nuts right now. So I gave him a carrot and he does not like. But I want to put this up. This is my next little project. I don't know. I don't really have any pictures that I could put in it. So I'm gonna attempt to just paint this bag piece. I have these little guys. Look how cute. Let's make some food. I haven't made a pancake in so long. I was actually kind of thinking like, should I make a waffle? But honestly, I'm craving a pancake. I just made one egg because since I'm having the pancake, you know, I don't want to eat a huge, huge breakfast. But yeah, it looks yummy. Pancake is ready. Look how delicious. Here's how we ended up looking. Okay, so honestly, I don't love how plain it is. I got this picture of Nick and I, and I was gonna put it in the middle, but I don't like how that looks either. So this is what I'm thinking. <laughs> I wanna write Stoffer on the back. Cause I'm thinking maybe just like something down the middle. I mean, I guess it's not the worst thing in the world. I mean, I don't hate it. But I kind of like that it almost looks a little messy. But then you can still see the last thing. He said we need a belt. Keep the knees bent for your first downward facing dog. Exhale, forward fold. Bend your knees, roll up arms upwards and back for three like a dog. Press into your palms just like a downward facing dog. You build around the left foot. Uh, especially if you can reach the foot with your right hand. I'll our own body weight on the hands and on the feet forward. Move through tabletop. Come onto the toes to downward facing dog. Very good. Draw the navel in. Bend. It's perfectly fine. Lower back down, let's do four more. Lift up, inhale, exhale, lower. Very good, set the hips down. <laughs> Beautiful. It just might be like this, this is as high as you can lift. Once you have that grip, hard and forcing two, and on the breath, observe the breath. Uh, oh my goodness, my legs, my abs. Oh, everything that was a little bit sore was so challenging to do. And that reverse tabletop, oh my God, I can't do that for nothing. I think because of my shoulders though, like my shoulders are always super tight. So like them being that far back, oh, that was hard. Now that there's room in the living room, I just laid out all my clean clothes because I'm doing laundry. Turn my heater on. Because in this cold weather, we cannot be showering with no heater. Beautiful. Face mask off. So after a face mask, I always like to do like a little, a little ice rub. I'm gonna do my eyebrows real quick though, cause now I'm gonna lie. I'm a hair girl. They just come back so fast. Fresh brows. I don't have a long skincare routine. I wanna get like another thing though. Like I, I feel like I need a serum, like something to just give it a little more glow, a little more hydration. I just made the best water. It's pineapple, honeydew, cucumber, a lemon, a lime. It is so, so good. And I made myself a chicken quesadilla. I mean a chicken, a shrimp quesadilla. And I did record making all of this because this is like my meal prep. This is gonna be for tomorrow. It's rice, shrimp, and zucchini over here. And so I'll just insert that video so y'all can see.
Look how good that looks. I'm gonna start doing this every week. I used to juice so often, I kind of stopped, but that is so freaking good. It's 10 o'clock, so I'm gonna go to bed. I'm kind of sad because my husband was supposed to call me today. And he hasn't even texted. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Good morning. This is the fit of the day. We got a little lace thing. I got this over my green pants. I was going to wear some different ones, but they're not as comfy. And I think since I'm doing my extension client today, I will want to sit down for some of it. Yeah, I'm just making breakfast right now. I'm making the same thing I made yesterday because it was just that good. I want it again. <laughs> Hey guys, made it home. It was a busy day today. I worked noon to eight. I did my extension client from noon till six. And then I had a haircut at six, a haircut at seven, finished at eight. I did the prettiest extension client yesterday and I just have to share. So color first, here's her before. We colored her to match the extensions, which was like a darker brown. While she was processing, I got the extensions ready. So there's that. And then we came back, dried her hair, did the first row. Here's the second row. Super satisfying. I love watching this. <laughs> but we put the beads in and then we put the row over and then we started sewing them on. And shout out to my speed because I'm really getting better at this. Um, but yeah, super satisfying. We just go in and do that. I oiled each little section also like on her scalp and here's her after look at the before can we believe that that's the same person like i love i love it she looks so pretty i love how it looks just like a natural balayage let me know what y'all think i watched my husband's game they played columbia today and of course i'm like doing i'm like working right this is my first day that he plays that i'm at work so I can't like sit there and watch and so I just had it on my phone and I just had it like on the side so that way I had the volume up enough that if they they made a goal they're like goal you know so like I would look I'm like oh who made it and they lost seven to three so this is like I don't know this is their third game that they lost in a row how good a shrimp if it's not in the fridge no more than two hours so you're telling me my whole lunch is bad? Oh, the struggle, man. It's because at work, we don't have a fridge anymore. That makes me so sad. Because, like, I really got to work and I could have went and taken it. But I'm like, it's just so far. It's not really, but, like, kind of is, you know? Like, I just want to have a fridge. I just want to have a break room and a fridge and a restroom. Like, I feel like everybody should have that in their workplace. And the fact that we don't have the most basic things... Cause we were talking about it today me and some of the other girls were like yeah they don't want us to use the restroom that's like the closest to us anymore we got to go all the way around and we can't have food anymore and i literally was like honestly the manager watched me eat an apple and i was looking right at her when i took a bite out of it sometimes the days are busy and we just have to eat when we can i just don't think it should be that big of a deal for them to like make it impossible for us to literally do basic life things like eat and use the restroom so yeah my lunch is bad Thankfully, I still have shrimp in the fridge, but like, food ain't cheap though. Oh, it's fine. One of the girls though got a pizza and she was not that hungry. She just wanted a snack. So I had like, I think like three pieces of her pizza. So that honestly was like the perfect lunch. Okay, so shrimp, rice, and some carrots. Esteban Arango, Esteban Sebastián Canizales. Como el guardameta. Espera, Lucho, te escucho. Señoras y señores, el árbitro pitó y la bocha rodó aquí en el coliseo cubierto de hockey. I will see you all tomorrow. Good morning. We did Zumba this morning. I got my overnight oats. Nick plays Mexico today. Oh my god, it kind of feels wrong not going for them. <laughs> hey guys. I just got off work and honestly, your girl is feeling a little bit like, I don't know, I don't really, I don't wanna cook more food. So I'm just gonna stop right now and get something and then I'll have my shrimp later tonight. Cause 
All I had today was quick oats and I had a granola bar and honestly that's not enough. And I got paid in cash, like my tips. So technically it's free. <laughs> All right, let's enjoy this sandwich. So I was about to go to bed and I realized like I have a lunch, but I don't have a breakfast. So I saw this girl on TikTok make eggs this way. I was so ready for bed, but I can't keep not having food at work. So and ignore the hair because I took my bun out and <laughs> so the eggs are just boiled eggs. You smash them up, put a little bit of mayo, and you just put them on your little sandwiches. I'm gonna make two actually, so that way I have a sandwich for tomorrow, which is Friday, and then another one for Saturday. See, this is the perfect little breakfast right here. An egg sandwich, poquito aguacate, tiene su queso. So yeah, tomorrow my plan is to wake up at seven. Wait, seven, eight. Oh, actually I need to wake up at like 6.30. Cause bro, pueden creer que la manager se cortó el cabello con la nueva. Empezó una hace como una semana, apenas lleva como dos semanas. Y le cortó el pelo a la manager y la verdad no sé por qué la dejó cortarle el cabello porque luego andaba llorando la pobre que no le gustaba su cabello que ya lo tenía muy largo y su cabello no le crece así que todo, anda la manager toda aguitada y quiere que yo se lo corte mañana para arreglárselo porque no le gusta cómo quedó. I'm just like, ok, pues si, si no te gustó pero quieres lo quieres más corto y you no, know, I don't know, it's fine. So we got breakfast for tomorrow, breakfast for the next day. Let me show ya. All right, that's the last thing I wanted to show ya before I go to bed. Um, but yeah, see y'all tomorrow. Today is my last day of work. Thank God, cause I, I just, I don't want to go. <laughs> Thankfully, I have some pretty transformations to do today. My friends from work are going out to downtown. And I do want to go. I just don't know if I want to go. I told one of my friends though, I was like, if I drive to your house, can I ride with you there? But I've never been to this place. I don't really know what to expect. They said it's like real good drinks, um, real good food. She said there's like Mexican paletas. I was like, oh, I'll definitely get one of those. <laughs> Oh my god, this was my pocket. And I washed these pants and everything. Wow. Hey, that just made my day. That just, hell yeah, I got a $20. I used to do that all the time in Texas. I would forget about money and I would stick it in my pockets because I got paid a lot in cash. And I would find it when I did laundry. It was the best. But here I don't really get cash like that, so. Love that for me. <laughs> so is there hair that's better than the other hair? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like I like this hair. This hair. <laughs> Some hair is a little more like silicone-y and so it slips real easy. Is this one a little bit hot? No, this one's good. I like this one. You're healing it? You're I'm tired. Feeling you get your hair that's relaxing, huh? Somebody's brushing your hair. Once the weather starts getting warmer, I gotta get it off. It's too hot. Oh, you do? Do you like to record or take pictures? What's your favorite? She likes to vlog. Oh. Well, not yet. First, we have to oil your scalp, baby hairs too. Can't forget the baby hairs. That's next. And then turn to the front again. <laughs> Let's see. Let's do a little closer. Hey guys. Okay, so backstory on today. I went to work all day. Did the prettiest braids. After I finished her braids, my camera freaking fell over and now it won't turn on. So 
I'm gonna go tomorrow to Best Buy. I'm not gonna worry about that because I can't stress over it. It's gonna be fine or it's not gonna be fine. So this is with my phone. But worked all day, it was pretty busy. I watched Nick's game. They won against Colombia, which is like history because now they're going to the A division for the next tournament and I don't I don't know if this has ever happened honestly so that's pretty freaking dope so shout out him and his team it was such a good game like I'm not even kidding this was a very good game I wish I could have watched it from start to end but it's fine they won Nick is MVP I think I don't know they interviewed him and said he was MVP so I'm assuming he's MVP um but yeah we're going out tonight so we're about to do that I might insert some clips of what we do I've never been to this place my god I'm still having hair all over me from haircut I've never been to this place so I don't know what to expect but they said it's a really cool vibe so we're gonna see I know hey, do MVP for the game <laughs> thank you I mean all we do is go out there and work together as a team honestly we're giving it our all. We left it all out there. We knew we had to do this, get this win, in order to go advance to the top eight in Italy. And that's where we start. Bueno, estaba muy contento porque han logrado estar entre las tres mejores selecciones. Y bueno, estaban, estaban preparados. Uh, what did you think in, in the, the last minutes? ¿Qué pensaba en los últimos? I'm sitting there shaking, you know. It's an adrenaline rush till the last second. And uh, just stand on your head. Defense played amazing for me. We kept everything out on our side. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Talia dice, claro que sí. Ahí estaban. Made it home. About to get in bed. It was so fun. I'm really glad that I won it. Good morning. Happy Sunday. Today I'm determined to be productive. So I'm going to Best Buy to take my camera. Hopefully it's an easy repair. The fact that it's still turning on and off gives me good, gives me hope, I guess. And then I do need to go to the grocery store. I have nothing to eat. I mean, I do, but I have no fruit. When I have no fruit, I feel like I have nothing. So I have to go to the grocery store, get some fruit. And then I found a gift card from a client that gave, that gave me one. Back for Christmas, she gave me a gift card for Ross for $25. So I'm gonna pass by Ross, see if there's anything I need. So yeah, Best Buy. Walmart, Ross. Oh, and I want to get thread from Walmart too because I have this project, a sewing project I want to do. So let's go. My man just shaved his head. <laughs> I just watched it on live on Facebook. Thank God one of the girls texted me and was like, hey, your man's about to shave your head or his head. And I was like, so real quick, I was literally like leaving Walmart because I went to Best Buy, dropped my camera off. It's gonna be a month or so, they said. So this is gonna be the last vlog for a while. This is my phone recording right now. So uh, it's okay though. I, it's gonna get fixed. It's fine. Um, not a big deal. And then I went to Ross and I got some goodies because I was telling y'all, did I tell you my client gave me a gift card? And so I got some like basic things that I just needed like this, this, this for the soap because I got this cute little soap that smells like peaches so that's for that and then i went to walmart and i got hella groceries right and i also got thread because i got a sewing project in mind and why is there more white that's my first question because i need more black i literally have like probably four of white ones already but it was cheaper to get the big pack so i was like you know what and i also got some new tijeras because if you saw my vlog when I was making my husband his USA jacket, I struggled and I, I swear it was the scissors. So I got these ones, hopefully they're much better. But then I was leaving Walmart and I, no, I was checking out and the girl texted me, she's like, oh my gosh, like your husband's about to shave his head. I'm like, so I'm in the freaking self checkout line watching it live on my phone. And then I finished watching it in my car cause I try to hurry, right? I was like, scan, scan, let's go, let's go, you know? Um, so yeah, when he comes back, he's gonna be bald. Which I'm gonna lie, he kept the beard. I knew, I was like, as long as he keeps the beard, he can be bald. <laughs> Cause um, not gonna lie, he was, he looks good. <laughs> he was like feeling himself. He said, he was saying in the live, he's like, I'm gonna leave this until the next tournament. I was like, all right, we'll see. We shall see. But it's crazy because I really did not think he was ever gonna shave his head. I mean, no, yeah, I never thought he would shave his head. I'm kind of nervous though. Like, how's he gonna look? Cause it, he looked good. <laughs> it's just funny. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> um, 
but you know, I'm kind of sad because it's gonna be my last vlog. I just wanted to give y'all that update. Um, I don't know if maybe I'll like finish recording today with my phone. I don't know. I don't know how how I'm feeling, but we shall see. Stocked up on fruit, thank God. Um, I do want to wash the dishes, put away my clean clothes that I have, like just like clean up around the house because I'm thinking I want to skate. It feels so good outside though. Maybe I should go for a walk. Honestly, I should go for a walk actually, hundred percent because it feels good. Like when I was passing by the park. I have never seen that many people playing basketball. Maybe I should go join the game, actually. I don't know. I need to do something outside. So, wash the dishes, do clothes, and take the trash out. Those are the three things I need to do right now. The kitchen looks so clean. My fruits are stocked up, which we love to see. So, I came to play basketball. And there was, like, a good game going on, like, 5 on 5 probably like five people on the side waiting too and i was just on the side shooting because i was like eh. i was like if they ask me i'll play but if they don't it's fine right wait so they ended up asking me and i played two games we won the first one lost the second honestly though, i haven't played basketball in a long time <laughs> so it was a little bit of a struggle because i was out of breath <laughs> and they're still playing now but i was like i'm done <laughs> And then after I played, I was like, you know what, I might as well skate because I brought my skates. And then it was too cute because then a lot of women came and like they're playing right now basketball, but the little girls that are with them, they went to the car and all get their skates on because they saw me skating. I was like, oh, how cute. But I already took mine off. So if not, I would have skated with them, but oh well. All right, walking back. It's so nice because it's so full. I love when the park is full. I just love nice weather because that attracts people to be outside. That's what I needed to cure my depression. Because now I'm not even sad anymore. I was so sad like the last four days. But now I'm great.